Recently NASA's rover on Mars captured this picture and if you look better you will notice this object in the distance. 12 seconds later on the next photo the object is gone. If it was on Earth the bunkers would say it's a distant plane leaving a condensation trail. I mean that's how they've debunked this video captured by the military in Chile that was analyzed by a group of scientists and the case remained unsolved. It's still unsolved because the debunkers theory is not solid. Clear cameras are not designed to capture planes 60 miles away and even if that was the case the signature would have been at least 10 times smaller. Now let's compare the UFO on Mars and the Chilean UFO. First notice this. They both appear like two objects stuck together. Also they are both leaving some sort of a trail behind them. Possibly it's connected to their propulsion system. Maybe it's connected to water. There are two solid cases where UFOs are sucking water from lakes. One is in Chicago from the Michigan Lake describing the latest Netflix episode of Unsolved Mysteries and the other is the famous testimony of Ingo Swan and the UFO he witnessed in an undisclosed area in Alaska. If they use water for their propulsion system, maybe they are getting rid of the water waste after the rest is converted into energy. Also these UFOs look similar to the leak released by Jeremy Corbell that was filmed by the Snoopy team at night. It looks like two separate objects stuck together. You can find all cases including the official photos of NASA in the description area of this video. This was a short unplanned analysis and I hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe, share and support me on Patreon for more videos. Some interesting animation explainers are coming soon. See you in the next video.